Hey guys, welcome to another episode from me, Crafty Genius here, with another FIFA Ultimate Team pack opening reactions, but this time we've got a bit of a twist, bit of a new announcement to make, so make sure you stay tuned right to the end of this video to learn all the latest info. So, here's the team of the week this week, and here's who we're trying to get. We really want to get Hatem Ben Arthur. He's an absolute god, and I really rate him from FIFA 12. He was one of our star performers, actually. And I did try him in FIFA 13 Ultimate Team, but he wasn't really as good as he used to be in FIFA 12. He was so overpowered, he was, like, probably better than David Luiz. He's one of those FIFA Ultimate Team favourites. Um... A bit like David Luiz. Ever since David Luiz has been so overpowered, he's got so much many more fans on when he plays football. And I'm a really big admirer of David Luiz, as well as uh, Hatton Ben Arthur. But we're trying to get Ben Arthur today. He's in form, rated 82. He did a really good performance the other weekend. Uh, but currently we're on the international break, so it's not that great really. But anyway, stop diverting from away from the topic. We've got some announcements to make. Uh, I don't know what you expect to see as a 1 millionth uh, view subscriber special where I get 5,000 subs or a million views but I'm thinking of starting to do a setup video because currently I've just invested in a new microphone I'm using a Samsung Meteor uh, microphone it just plugs straight in the USB from my Mac and it's easy as that piece of cake so I hope you find that the audio quality as well as my editing has got a little bit better since uh, oh, two, three years ago now. I've done over 200 videos, which is a bit crazy to be honest, because it's a bit of a hobby. It's more of a hobby than making money, but ever since I joined Machinima back in 2012, I'd say September 2012, I haven't been with them that long. Um, it's been really good for my channel, it's really helped, and it'd be interesting to see how many of you have been uh, partnered up with channels, how many of you are looking to get to Machinima and what would be your defining moment of your YouTube channel? What would make you think you've hit the jackpot? Because personally I think 1 million views is such a big milestone that so few YouTubers do hit. And it does take a lot of hard work but at the same time I enjoy it doing my YouTube channel. And it's just a hobby to do on the side to sh showcase all of my gameplay off to you. I might do a Q&A video so if you have any questions or anything always be sure to leave them in the comments or tweet me over at Crafter Genius. And there I'll be able to reply to you. But yes, I have recently, uh, in the past couple of videos, I've struggled with a bit of a writer's block. Um, just trying to think of what new series to start up. But if you just skip over to the gameplay now, I do get out and back into the store. And I'm just wondering, do any of you guys have those sort of rituals where you think a different player on the front of the pack would give you better cards? Because I always try and find Joe Hart. A Joe Hart card on the front typically does well for me. I think... Um, I always try and get Joe Hart and normally he produces and I did get a Dean Natale before all of this pack opening unfortunately I didn't record it because I already have Dean Natale uh, in my team and I didn't expect to get much from opening one pack but I got a Dean Natale and I sold him for 25,000 coins that's the reason for this pack opening uh, I never like to spend real money I've only done it once I spent 20 pounds on my uh, 1,000 subscriber special and that was only last year that was crazy at the start of FIFA 13 I got my thousand subscribers but now I'm heading over to 5,000 which is absolutely mental but yeah I'm looking to start a new series I've been struggling with ideas but I think I've settled down on a pack and play series I just like to let you know that that's in the pipeline I'm gonna start to open more packs and start to save all the players to my club now rather than quick selling them as I do in this video um, be sure to leave your comments down below as to what rules you'd like to see applied for the entire entirety of the series um, I'm thinking maybe have like the whole have one team just full of pack players and I can't sell them and all those sort of rules so let me know what you think if I should do uh, tournaments if you think I should do if, different different types of packs should I do silver bronze and gold but I personally like to do gold packs just because it's more exciting when you see a player flash up who you know and talking of which I do get a Paulinho in this pack probably the best player I've got today I'm afraid guys, he's just recently transferred over to Tottenham so I did think he went for a little bit but I don't think he actually sells in the end. Anyway, we are wrapping up this video very quickly, we've had about 5 pack openings here. Um, be sure to let me know in the comments what sort of rules you'd like applied to this new pack and play series, how many packs you'd like to see me open, what sort of packs, if you want to do um, 
pink slips i'm open to all possibilities so next video guys is probably going to be a minecraft episode i've been doing a lot of minecraft recently and uh we'll be able to do some more fifa 13 gameplay and pack and play first episode straight after that as well so i'll see you all soon guys peace out